Today we are watching the best fans in the Eredivisie. A club full of passion always getting behind the team. And today Feyenoord find themselves in the quarterfinal versus AZ Alkmaar. They just beat league leaders PSV to reach this stage in what was a mental atmosphere. Feyenoord have won this cup 13 times with AZ winning 4. But only one team can win tonight and we've also got some exclusive seats. I will be in hospitality, the players lounge and once again have a fantastic view of the action. When you talk about a proper football stadium, this is it and I cannot wait to experience it for the fourth time. I am on the road to 100 thousand subscribers so if you are new please subscribe let's head to rotterdam as we're in for one hell of an experience oh and we're back we are back at home the netherlands you all know i love it here. i've just got off the bus we're now into eindhoven central i think we're going to head to the psv stadium to check it out as i'm with my mate karim over here he's with me for the next three days we've got a whole tour on the cards and you've got to stick with me and subscribe and like all of the videos because this is going to be mayhem and this is his first time in the netherlands as well and he's in for a treat so far so good he's loving it jesus christ i know i say it every single time but look at the amount of bikes around here. There's more bikes than people around here so far. What's going on? Even the graffiti design around here. Like, look at that design. Some talented artists are around here, I tell you that now. It's so impressive. And then all the graffiti in this tunnel as well, leading to the stadium. And the Philips Stadion must be one of the best designs in the Netherlands. And if you haven't watched my video where I've been to PSV, you got to check it out. What do you think of it, Karim? Unbelievable. One word answer, it's that sensational. The fact that Feyenoord are in the quarter-final is because they beat this team, PSV. It's a fantastic stadium, but nevertheless, I think they've only drawn two games this season. And here we go. We are going to Rotterdam. And here we are then, Rotterdam. What is going on here then? Welcome to Rotterdam, people. <laughs> what is going on here? Oh my god. Just to clarify, it's all practice and everything. This isn't actually a real situation. I would not want to get attacked by that beefy little dog. Enough about the dogs. The one thing which surprises me every single time is the houses, the architecture, everything about them. Like, it's just so unique and very different to what I'm used to seeing. I'm always such a big fan of all of it, and it is such a clean country, Netherlands. Normally, if you go through a park or something in England, it's bottles and all dirty, but here it's perfect. It is just lovely here. I love it. We're doing a bit of sightseeing of Rotterdam right now. We've got the cube buildings right in front of us, looking very spectacular. Very different to the normal buildings as everywhere around here. It's just so unique. And then in here, I think it's like a food court. I've been in there before. Like, this is what I mean. Look at the design in this place. Just lost for words at this point about this country. So we've done a lot of walking, a lot of sightseeing around Rotterdam, but once I finish up this Coca-Cola, we'll be heading to the De Quip. I cannot wait for tonight's atmosphere and tonight's experience is gonna be special. And here we are then, De Quip. We have made it. Isn't this just a proper football stadium though? Under the lights tonight, oh, this could this could be magical. It has so much potential. Give this one a review. Uh, 9.5. When you think about a traditional football stadium, which has got a lot of character, a lot of impact with the fans and the atmosphere, this is exactly it and you're gonna see that tonight. Yes, yeah, thank you. Right, and we're inside where all the players, family, friends, everyone, you get free drinks in here, absolutely everything before we go and take a look at our seat and view inside the stadium. The service is phenomenal, the stadium's phenomenal, this place is phenomenal. You know, it's time for the atmosphere. You've got the RZ team coach here, but the stadium is just, oh, I can't get enough of it. The character about it, everything. KK, up these stairs, and the view is something. Oh my God, my fitness is bad. And we are back, oh yes. It's just a proper football stadium. This is gonna be something, man. I have been here three times before, and it's always been three Feyenoord wins. And this time as well, there's actually AZ fans. On paper, Feyenoord should win, but you never know a night like tonight. going off here between the Feyenoord fans and RZ. Oh, I know there's a barrier between it, but this is quite nice. Love a bit of pre-match aggro. Whoa, oh! <laughs> what is going on? He nearly swung into the bottom tier. Here we go then. Feyenoord versus RZ, Altmar. The pyros are already going off. In the Feyenoord section, this is what it's all about. And this should be a good game. Two attacking sides. Look at this. Listen to this. 
Come on, this should be exciting. Looks like a bonfire at the seats down here. Goals, action, a lot. We won it all. Here we go, and we've kicked off it. Just need a good game now. And to be fair, you can't fault the away fans. You can't fault it. I've been before, good atmosphere, good fans as well. We're 11 minutes in. I feel like both teams are playing very cautiously. Obviously, there's a lot at stake here. I can understand. A lot of respect around the stadium. A lot of applause. In fact, a lot, a lot, a lot of respect. It's the roar. When the fans roll like that, it's so loud, it's deafening. I'll tell you what, it's so close for a perfect ball there. Shoots. Ooh! The roar again. I love the roar they do after a chance. Oh my God. Yeah! Look at the scenes here. The grip has erupted. They found the breakthrough. What a header that was. Oh my god, the ground's shaking! It's shaking! <laughs> my word, the ground was shaking there. Everyone erupted, the stadium erupted. What's ahead of that was, by the way? And that is exactly what they deserve. Have you seen Ipswich Town uh, rock like that? <laughs> Never mate. No. Oh, they're checking VAR. It might be a possible offside. When the ball went in, it did look a little bit tight to be fair. And if it's taken this long, you know what that could mean. Oh, it's offside. I said fans. I'll let an FA and fans know. That is so unfortunate because the stadium just erupted there. First time. Go on. <laughs> there it is. And this one will count. They've found a breakthrough and it's been deserved. And the stadium is shaking once again. That goal will count and what a time to do so just before half time. That was an absolutely beautiful goal. Good ball in everything, good finish. Matty Ryan can get it. And there it is, 1-0 to Feyenoord just before half time. And that is half time here. A good first half, a goal disallowed, but one which counted. A really enjoyable half of football. We'll see what the second half brings. Oh my God, what a oh. ball. Oh. Feyenoord have started the second half strong. If they get that second, there's a lot more of a breathing space for them. Oh! Now that was definitely a chance, just wide. 20 minutes remain here. Honestly, anything could happen at this point. Whoa. The striker, the big man, the one I've been relying on all season, Santiago Gimenez is coming off. Oh, that's a good ball. Wow! He just did not expect it to come his way at all. See you later, pal. See you later. Oh, go on. Wrap it up. What a ball that is! Squeeze it! Oh! What a goal! What a goal that is! Oh, that is incredible! And the stadium is literally shaking again. That was an unbelievable goal. The through ball, the passing, honestly, everything about it was delicious. It was fantastic. The seeds, the celebrations, it was all brilliant. And that should be a place in the semi-final. The 86th minute, wow, wow. And now the final fans are just waving to the RZ fans. Oh dear. I do like RZ as a club. I've been there, fantastic stadium, lovely people. I do love it there. But it's been a great occasion today as well. And that is it, Feyenoord are in the semi-finals. A really brilliant experience here, I really enjoyed it. And that is now the fourth time I've seen Feyenoord win at this stadium, De Quip. It always explodes when they score, the stadium always shakes. It's been a fantastic time, and that is day one complete of the Dutch tour. Leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you later.